honestly, the goal for me is when I look at bodybuilding, I look at it as an art. So I always had a love for it. So I never played any sports in school. For me, it was always about lifting weights and trying to make muscles grow. I'm not the type that wants to put on 30 pounds in a year or, you know, I'm not trying to be 350 pounds. I don't care about that. I just want to present and create a beautiful package. You know, you know I wanted my physique to be looked upon as beautiful, not like, wow, that's insane. Wow, that's intense. Wow, that's crazy. I wanted to be like, oh my God, that's beautiful. I don't go to a competition to win first place. I don't go to a competition to win money. I don't go to a competition to beat anybody. Uh, I go to a competition to try to display an era of bodybuilding that I fell in love with. My vision never changed. Uh, sometimes I feel like I'm the last of the Mohicans, right? I was working 14 hours a day. I was sleeping two or three hours a day. I was falling asleep on the gym floor. You know, I, I was doing cardio, you know, during the breaks at work and stuff like that, trying to get it in, man. And But, but I can remember when I turned pro, nobody was ever talking about golden era physiques. Nobody was talking about old school physiques. Nobody was talking about aesthetics. I don't give a damn if I finish 30th in a field of 25. I will go to the gym and I will develop my physique and I will pose my ass off because this is my art and it's what I love. Because I'm a grown ass man about mine, you know, so I just do what I got to do and I go to work, you know, regardless of what these people want to try to say, you know. I think when it comes to the physical development, I think that Cedric was ahead. But hey, if Arnold like me, I don't give a fuck if I win or not, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Bodybuilding is something that I do because I love it, so um, let it be something that you do because you have love for it, you know?